Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. I came from Iraq. I came from Al Yasiri family. I am married, 52 years old. I have four children. One of many of Iraqi women who were suffering a long period of persecution. At 1979, my husband was arrested by the security police and they put him in a prison for many years. Well, I had no idea about him. In 1982, he could flee from Iraq toward Iran, so he left me alone with three children. I did many work to keep my children alive. I made a bread oven. Also, I changed my living area many times to avoid arresting. At 1995, by help of relatives, I could flee to Iran, and there I met my husband after 16 years. Five years later, we decided to start a risky journey to Australia. More than two months in the Indian Ocean, three times we were about to sink we lost everything until saving by Australian Navy before we've been about to lose our lives. Now we are in a very beautiful country. We try to forget all the previous tragedy to live our beautiful life with good people we met. From knowing the refugee liaison worker Lina Hassan at Darbin Community Health Center, Lina, she explained to me about Iraqi Women Refugee Group. I did join them in 2004, the Iraqi Women Group. We benefited from attending the group, from accessing the health services, and benefited from learning English from price. Being physically and emotionally healthy, follow up a good diet. I am now aware of healthy eating, more vegetable and fruit, reduce fatty food. I baked my own bread using wholemeal flour. Being active, walk to shop. I am trying to look after myself. When my health are good, I can look after my family and being a role model to them. My advice to all newly arrived refugees, especially women, to be linked with community group, it's very important. I suffer from depression and high blood pressure. From attending women group, it helps us with education on health information, how to access public transport, and the Rabin Community Health Service, I am very happy the cost and the service. We have a staff, they treat us good treatment. Also, I'm using the optometry service. We access the cost of the frame very reasonable. We all refugee and we need to look for low cost. Now, I become a leader to all newly arrived refugee. I advise them when first arrived that their health come first. Any sign of sickness, they should go to the access health appointment. Thanks for all those who help us to restore our lives in Australia.